Hi Aquarius, uh, welcome. Uh, this is going to be a weekly oracle uh, message, uh, but even though the intention for the reading is for the week, time is fluid, uh, there's always some type of timeless uh, message and insight that can be received at any given time and i'm also going to this this is also a reading that kind of gives a glimpse into what type of new moon uh experiences um what type of uh energies might be as well a part of that monthly cycle ahead so as always keep in mind that this is only a general reading uh only take what it feels right and with what does resonate within your own life experiences during this time if you would like to have a personal reading with me please contact me through the email I put in the description box below or if you would like to donate and support my channel you can also do so by following the PayPal link which is also down below okay so Aquarius it does feel like there's this bright like a sense of a bright hope light um, direction idea something like feels like eminent and almost like as well unexpected like some of you are really receiving here some sort of powerful um idea something is coming to your mind and you're seeing like uh for some of you you're seeing like that's the you know uh right direction or where you should be heading but it feels like some of you are not you know in a moment where you feel like you have everything to reach that same goal or intention so there are things that seem to be holding back some of you Aquarius from achieving goals from achieving your desires which are very intense and growing to be even more intense by the day with this intensity card so there's this feeling of some of you are really you know going to have more and more the certainty of where you should be heading with something that activate i'm sorry activates passion uh interest simulation um in your uh self and in your life but being that you have the outside outsider card i keep getting like whatever this bright colorful again energy that um you're realizing okay that you're seeing as uh, possibly being your source of happiness or your source of success because this is a rainbow um card so it's associated with the earth element um whatever you're seeing that could be like it um you still have you know a barrier that keeps you from achieving uh, what you want and for some of you it's issues of self-worth okay it's issues of not um not thinking okay or not believing or feeling like you are enough um some of you are not confident in whatever this uh thing is it's like you're seeing it you see that it, you could be a part of it you really want to be a part of it but either you don't believe like you have the the, the set of skills or energies or whatever to do a good job right or good performance at it or you're just you know scared you're really scared to leave kind of the lone wolf energy here that some of you have been on to to be a part of life uh, some of you have been lonely a long time or have been um you know again on the sideways of a situation where you should be more involved some of you it's due to fear again um it's due to fear of going at that level with the intensity card it's almost like this sensation um that if you go there you're really going to be hugely transformed and um you're not going to be able to back off um when you want to because i feel like some of you this is a matter of avoidance of getting you know mixed here with the situation that is going to uh bring about powerful changes in your own energy and perhaps as well in those uh, around you and it's almost like um i don't want to say coward energy but it's what's coming up it's like almost like your coward there's a this this this, this um issue with cowarding when you should be um manning up or when you should be brave uh so i feel like this week and ahead um particularly as we go into next month there will be tests with being brave okay being courageous being confident being bold being yourself okay um in situations where you know that you want it or you know that you could reap from it 
a lot of positive things, but you're stopping yourself. Why? Again, anything that during this time you're you're resisting or stopping yourself from doing, I feel like it's um uh, there's a need to question yourself why you're doing that. Be honest about really what's stopping you. If it's really because you don't have, you know, sometimes we give a lot of excuses, right? Oh, I don't have the money to do that. Or I don't have, you know, anyone to go with me and do that. Or whatever, whatever we tell ourselves many times. Um, in reality, there's a deeper truth to that, that it's not about what we're presenting. And many times it's just a fear of, you know, showing ourselves, uh, a fear of showing up to something because we are insecure, because we feel undeserving or unlovable or whatever. So there's that attention here to not put yourself on the sideways again, to not put yourself away from something you should be in. So I hope you have a great week. Again, if you'd like to have a personal reading with me, uh, contact me through the email that is in the description box below. I hope you have a great week and a great new moon cycle and hopefully we'll see each other soon.